Yeah. We change seats between every song, so you can too if you want. <laughs> now, are there any? Is there any like extra magic space in here? There's sort of people from sort of piled up there. No. All right. Just so we know. <laughs> Thanks for being here, everybody. <laughs> and thanks to Lucy's Lounge for creating the aphrodisiaholic. Yeah. And the great, um, I've got some ginger, I went to the bartender looking for some water, hot water for my ginger honey lemon concoction in my vase for my little thing for my throat. And he's like, how about this homemade ginger honey lemon concoction. <laughs> it's amazing. They've got it's perfect. It's what I needed all week long. You got it all? It's right there. Wow. Yeah. Um, all right. Sometimes why? Four food groups. Four main songwriting themes. Love. Lust. Adventure. And regret. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes all in one song. Well, Melinda, she was a looker, but she was looking the wrong way. This here's the story of what happened that day. See, her man, his name was Elmer. You heard me right. It took years of tears, but she finally left him last night. Her friends, they'd long told her it was past time to go. And Chloe, she'd said, come stay with me here in Ohio. So Linda didn't pack much, just one big box. But hey, what's this now? Is she having second thoughts? Oh no, baby. Oh no, no. But didn't you hear? You don't put on your lipstick in the rear view mirror. Well, in the job nine hours, almost got a room and said I'm done. And the 7 a.m. sunrise caught her still on the roof. She finally got hung up in the Cleveland commute and said she wasn't going 80. She took one hand off the wheel and fumbled in her purse for some blush and some concealer. She caught her own reflection, baggy eyes, messy hair. Well, then suddenly a fright. She'd left the curling iron on back there. Oh, no, baby. a trip to France. I should have given Elmer a thousand second chance. We planted tulips last fall and I'd like to see them coming up. And Elmer used to be so I'm sorry, sweet. I must interrupt. Oh, no. Nobody died. I mean, I think even that hearse was empty. They just buried. <laughs> <laughs> 
the guy. And as the sirens and lights filled the emergency lane, there were 12 drivers that had already pegged our Linda. See, the evidence was clear, smeared all over the windshield. No, it wasn't blood. It had that Maybelline. Maybe it's Maybelline. <laughs> There was this rubbernecking driver, she was coming the opposite way. He seemed pretty clear on the story, he leaned out the window to say. And now it might not be my business, but I mean it kindly. Hindsight's 2020, but it can also blind you. From where I stand, I think it might help you to know. Next time you leave home, keep your eyes Yeah.